this little beauty is the Oak Classic Penny Whistle in D. It is apparently made in Ireland at this time, although from the reading I was doing it was made in the US at one point. May have been designed in Ireland, maybe not. Um, I think that Oak is now owned by Fadog, but what I understand is that they're not just putting the Oak name on Fadog whistles, they're making the Oak whistles to the original standard. It is a brass body that is then triple dipped in nickel. So it gives it this nice, shiny, heavy feel. And all of that density gives it that bird-like, bright, fife sort of sound that you heard a moment ago. Despite my scratchy throat and other excuses I'll make for my bad playing, this thing has volume for days. It has exactly the tone that I was looking for. So when I got this whistle, once I had a little feel around with it, immediately happy. This is probably my third favorite whistle that I have. And the only thing that beats it, I paid for that thing. It's amazing, honestly. If there's a con that I can mention, the two finger C natural, might sound a little weird, but if you do these two holes in addition, it's bright and clear. I think that this is probably bar none the best starter whistle that anyone can get. Now there are people that don't agree with that or wouldn't agree with that because they are looking for something in tone other than I am. They might like a quieter whistle with a softer tone or a more woody, open, mellower tone that you would get from perhaps a Clark or some, some other brass whistle. That's fine. That's what this is all about, is, is finding what you like. But I can't tell you enough how much I love this thing. It is brilliant. I think I paid maybe $13, $14 US for this. If you like bright tone and you're not afraid of a little volume, this is your man. It doesn't require too much breath. It doesn't usually overblow too easily. It's just, it's just perfect for me. At this point, I've got 48 weeks or so more worth of whistles to go through and demo for you. But if there's something in particular you'd like to hear, you can certainly request or, or comment on this page or my social media, anywhere you can find Wolf Downard. If you have something that you think would impress me or think would impress everyone else and you feel charitable enough to send it to me to demo, ask away. Or if you are a whistle maker and you would like to get my honest feedback and see your whistle demoed here on this series, I'm all for that too contact me. Although it is early days yet, I want to put as much information into the hands and eyes and ears of anyone who happens to watch this. I'm certainly entertaining all suggestions and options. I'm Wolf. This was my Whistle of the Week. I look forward to seeing you next week when we'll check out another whistle.